They had already done a, a sequence in the movie with basically a silhouette of the creature. There was a hand that came around a door and you could see the silhouette of his head. So Marius just told me, he gave me some kind of guidelines about how big the creature was going to be and, and I just used that silhouette to kind of as a guide to making this thing and I sculpted him out of clay. He liked it. I, I think I did some sketches first and then, you know, yeah, he, he, he okayed it. He green lighted it. It was three, maybe four months of work. The battle sequences all took place. The, uh, the, the uh, integration with the characters all took place in this one room. Uh, it was the, all of those shots were done. All the, all the background elements, the live action elements were all done in that basement on, in one day. That, yeah, the, and again, there was one other stop motion shot where they just had a background that they'd already shot and they wanted me to put it in. But, but as far as the, the interaction with the characters, with, with the, uh, the uh, actors, uh, that, that was all done in one day in the basement of P Pensner Art, Marius's father's uh, shop where he sold paintings and things in the basement. He starred in one more little uh, production and that was the ZZ Top music video TV dinners. And again, it was because of Marius uh, producing this uh, uh, music video for, uh, for ZZ Top. He was at Ardent Teleproductions then and uh, they, they let him choose uh, one of the tracks off the album and he, he chose the most unusual one, which was TV dinners, and he came up with the idea of the little creature coming out of the TV dinner. So yeah, we, we, uh, we animated him for that too.